Hello YouTube, hello MCTAL, hello Red Pill, this is Red Pill in the Wind. Now, what I'm about to say here, I'm going to justify not buying anything from, not, not paying for an OnlyFans model. Now, first thing I'm going to say is at the $1 to $5 tier, I'm going to tell you some of the things you can get instead of paying for an OnlyFans model. You can get two packs of gum with that $1. For 5 bucks, you can get a whole crap ton of gum out of the vending machine and potentially a meal before or after taxes. I still have some change left over. At the ten dollar tier, I know you could pay. You could put gas in your in your vehicle. Now, I know some of your vehicles are running on empty, but y'all up here paying for these darn old OnlyFans models. But your tank, but your tanks running on E. Your tanks on E. I ain't stupid. You know, at the fifteen or twenty dollar level, again. Your tank's on empty, your car needs oil, your car, your car needs new headlights, but you pay for an OnlyFans model. At the $50 tier, you could literally fill your tank up and have money left over to get you something to eat. But you're hungry and your car's running out of gas. At the $100 tier, that's, your, that's a lot of most people's phone bills, actually. And some change left over. For food for the week or the day, at the hundred, at the two hundred dollar, the hundred fifty dollar range, now you're getting into some into some big money here. You're getting in some big money, big but big fella, big strapper. Your car, your car needs you. You're, you're running on a donut. You're literally up here running on a donut on your spare tire. You need a new tire for your car, but you're up here paying these OnlyFans models. After the four to five hundred dollar range, come on, people, that's half of the rent. That's half of your the rent. That's half of your rent. You need yet four new brand new tires for your car. Come on, come on, wake up, people. What y'all doing? That's half of your rent. A pair paying five hundred dollars for an OnlyFans model to look socially awkward. Heck, you can literally go up to Rossi's at the, at the flea market on Saturday and Sunday, buy you a whole, buy you a bunch of swords. You can buy you a gaming consoles, and with games, y'all some messed up in there. You, you 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 get once you get to the thought, once you get to the five to above six hundred. You you got a problem. I mean, you got a problem. One, you got a problem at at, at at twenty at spending twenty bucks at eighty. You got a problem at eighty dollars. But now you got now your problems begin to multiply and compound on each other. Once you have hit five hundred to a th and to a th six hundred to thousand dollars, that is rent in some parts of the country, or half of some rent in some parts of the country. Y'all, mugs actually do spend thousands of dollars on some on some socially on some socially awkward cam girl to watch some cam girl be socially freaking awkward. You couldn't get me to donate to an OnlyFans model if you've had a gun pointed to my head. They don't. You couldn't get me to date an OnlyFans model if you had a gun pointed to my head. Better get you better you better t teach that OnlyFans model to 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 look to learn how to use chloroform and put me in, and, and throw my behind in a white condoline van, cause that's about the only way an OnlyFans model's gonna have anything to do with me. And even then, you gotta catch me off guard. If you look suspicious, I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna let you go first. I'll follow behind. I'll follow and go in a different direction than you. But if you look suspicious, I'm going to sit here and wait for you to disappear. 
up here uh, dealing with these OnlyFans models. And on top of that, what makes you think that I'm going to date anybody? Because, I mean, I, I work so hard for everything that I got, everything that I earned, everything that I bought. Everything, you know, me, my family have worked so hard for everything that we got. You know, it ain't just me. It's me and my family. So if you weren't there with me from day one, well, you're in for a big surprise when you go ahead and try to date me. Yep. It ain't going to happen, bucko. You ain't, and on top of that, shoot, these women ain't built like that. These women ain't built like that. They ain't got it like that. Wow. I'm sitting here at this East McKeesport guest get-go, talking crap a mile a minute, you know? That's some crazy stuff right there. But guess what? I ain't got nothing to worry about. I ain't got nothing to worry about. Don't nobody want me. And that's a good thing. I ain't got nothing to worry about. Sitting, I, I look here, I, I dropped my location. Well, I ain't dropped the location where I reside, but I uh, I am in East McKee. I am sitting here in this East McKee's port get-go talking crap. I told you in my last video, I don't care if you're cartel, Yakuza, gang, crip, blood, uh, goddamn Black Panther, doesn't matter to me. I'm going to talk crap, and whether you like it or not, oh well, don't care. Not my problem. But hey, I got to go. I got to get back home. I got to do some installations or some things. This is Red Pill in the Wind signing off.